Hello everyone, welcome to WP Game. In this video training, we will learn how to backup and restore WordPress website using Updraft Plus WordPress backup plugin. Okay, so I am in the home page of Updraft Plus WordPress backup plugin. And using this backup plugin, we can backup our WordPress website to Dropbox, Google Drive, Backspace Cloud, and many other storage platforms. So, go to the dashboard of your website and I am in the dashboard of my website and from the plugins menu, I am going to click on add new menu. From here, I will search for updraft plus plugin. Here it is and I am going to install it. The plugin has been installed. Now, it is time to active the plugin. The plugin has been activated and you can see there are the menus, the setting menus. You can go through this menu and properly set up this plugin or you can go here in the setting menu and you will find updraft plus backups. It has redirected me to the dashboard of updraft WordPress backup plugin. At this moment, I am in the current status tab. And here you can see three buttons backup now, VS Store, clone, or migrate. Before I take a backup, I should go to the settings tab. And from here, I can set up file backup schedule. It will be happen 4 hours, every 4 hours, every 12 hours, daily, weekly, monthly. Okay, I prefer daily. Database backup daily. Okay, and how many backup? One should be better. You can make it two also. It's up to you. And from here, I can choose a remote storage. As you can see, there are many options, but I prefer Dropbox or Google Drive. Dropbox is my first choice and second choice is Google Drive. I can get their service at free. Also, you can choose Microsoft Open Drive. If you would like to get your backup in Dropbox, just click here and you will get a link to set your backup with Dropbox settings. Before I do that, I am going to check other things and include in files backup. Do you want to backup your plugins, themes, uploads, anything else? If you don't want to backup your plugins, just uncheck this. If you don't want to backup your uploads, just uncheck this. And email. If you want to get email notification in your admin email address just set this up and finally save changes and it pops up with a link to configure your dropbox account with updraft plus just click this link and open it in a new tab just sign up with your Dropbox authentication then it will synchronize with just it will link up with updraftplus.com okay now I'm going to take a backup just I'm going to click on current status button and backup yes I would like to backup database I would like to include any file in the backup and send this backup in the remote storage okay i will keep it in my server so backup now you can check the log file from here and just reload it and you can see existing backup on 
it means it has one copy of backup of your site just see it has your database backup your plugins backup themes backup upload backups and others if you want to restore you can check all the backups here just click on database it shows an option download to your computer you can download your database to the computer or delete from your server okay i'm going to download here and plugins backup okay you can check everything here and if you would like to restore just click on this restore button okay i'm just going to click on this restore now restore button okay what do you want to restore your database your others file uploads themes plugins you can also restore everything and then click on this restore button again that's pretty simple okay i'm not going to do that and now you can check advanced tools also from here you can know about your site information log setting etc and file size okay let's see what about my plugins file size 30.7 mb theme size very simple and some premium extension if you just want to get this add-ons just you can upgrade to premium and before i finish i'm going to hit on this current status button and from here you can backup again or restore from any existing backups hope you could understand and could take backup of your wordpress website if you face any problem please let me know in the comment box of this video in the youtube and please like and share this video and subscribe to my youtube channel thank you very much